Hey everyone, welcome back. And today we will be doing another lead code problem six four five set mismatch. An easy one. You have a set of integer s which originally contains all the numbers from one to n. Unfortunately, due to some error, one of the number in s got duplicated to an other number in the set. which results in repetition of one number and the loss of another number you are given an integer array nums representing the data state status of this set after the error find the number that occurs twice in the number uh, and the number that is missing and return them in the form of, of an array so if we have 1 2 2 4 then we can say a 2 is the duplicate and the number which should have uh, been in this array at the position uh, at not the position 2 but uh, in the place here 2 is uh, is 3 so we can just return it and now if we have 1 1 we can say that the 1 is duplicate and also in the place here we are going to have 2 so we'll be returning 2 in that case so what we will be doing is just first of all taking the length so the n will be the length of nums and then we are going to find the arithmetic progression of, of this n so because it is from 1 to n and we know that if we have arithmetic progression we can add you can say uh, the sum uh, you know what arithmetic progression is like we can have if we have a uh, one to n elements then if we apply the sum of the arithmetic ex expressions Uh, arithmetic progression to it then we can have uh, the expression like uh, adding them all up for example if this n was 10 then we are going to add 1 to 10 in which the formula in that case is going to be n plus 1 and then divided by 2 and now we can easily find the missing number which will be uh, like if we take this arithmetic progression and subtracted by the set and uh, let me just sum of the set of nums okay so it will remove the duplicate so in this case let me just write it down 1 2 1 2 4 and then the sum is going to be uh, let me just write the whole code then i will explain how things work and duplicate duplicate is going to be let me just write it dupe okay so we can find the duplicate easily by just taking the sum of the original nums subtracting it by the arithmetic progression we have adding the missing number so this what this will do is we have the sum of the nums and we know that it is always going to be less than the arithmetic progression of you can say n numbers 1 to n numbers so the sum will always be less than ap arithmetic progression and then we are going to add the missing number because we know that that missing number is going to complete the deficiency which is going to be this which is this nums have and the exceeding part is going to be uh, just the duplicate so after that we can just return the dupe and the missing number and that's it let me see if this works and then we i will explain how this works in a bit more detail okay this works and let's see how this works we have the uh, an array like this in which the n is going to be 4 and is the length we calculated it so now if we apply ap arithmetic progression formula to it we are going to have let me just write the formula okay so 4 multiply by 5 because 4 plus 1 is going to be 5 and this is going to be 20 and 20 divided by 2 is going to return 10 so the ap is going to be 10 okay and uh, yes we can see that if we have uh, 3 here then we are going to have 10 as a sum so this is correct our arithmetic progression is correct everything is all right and now if we uh, want to find the missing number we can just simply do ap minus 
sum of the set which will just remove the num so 2 is removed because it is a set set cannot have duplicates element and the missing number is going to be 10 minus 7 and which will be the 3 so this 2 is still here we just make the set another set not uh, disturbing the original you can say array so now we can find the duplicate by let me just write its formula to you minus our ap plus the missing number so what is happening here is we can find the sum by just <laughs> taking the sum and it is like 9 so the sum is 9 of the original array and its ap arithmetic progression is 10 plus the missing number the missing number is going to be 3 so 3 and if we solve them like this is going to just return true uh, 2 so we know that 2 was our uh, duplicate number so that's it this is how things work and if you have any kind of questions you can just ask them in the comments and that's it